Hey guys, Josh here, filming a new video today. I'm just redoing the intro at the moment because the one I had earlier wasn't the greatest. So our today's video is just going to be on decluttering that clothing rack you see back there pretty much. Um, kind of my first step into minimalism. Um, not going full out or anything, but just more decluttering and kind of making a more active approach on the things that I own and the things that I use versus the things that I don't use and could throw away or donate. So that'll be today's video. Um, before the video even starts, if you guys could leave a thumbs up on the video, that'd be great. Um, since I am a smaller channel, uh, just trying to grow, that'd be great to build some exposure as well as maybe get the YouTube algorithm to pick up the video, but I do appreciate it. So let's get on into the video. Methods I'll be using for today is kind of just his method slash it's kind of the Marie Kondo, Con Marie kind of way of doing things. So today I'll be just focusing on my closet, just closed to the end. It's not going to be more in depth really. It's just gonna be, I'll be doing kind of two factors. Have I worn this item in the past 30 days or so? And I'm kind of leaving out outerwear and seasonal items because I live in Minnesota here. And the second method is just that, does it bring you joy? Um, part of Marie Kondo's method is just if you're getting rid of some stuff, if it brings you joy, it's better to keep it than cause you stress. So there'll be a couple items in here where I don't really wear it anymore, but it does, you know, bring back memories. I'll explain that later, but let's get started. So guys, the main focus for me today is kind of just clearing up my clothing rack right now. Right now it's pretty, as you can see, it's overflowing with clothes at the moment. I just want to organize this up, get rid of anything that I don't really need or don't use too much, and kind of just get it looking a lot better than this. So let's get started. and finally cleared up all of the stuff off the clothing rack. I think for this first portion, I'll just be doing two piles, kind of, or I'll have three actually. Uh, one, definitely keep it. Two would be definitely giving away, donating, or kind of just reselling online if I could. And the third would be maybe pile, where it's kind of seasonal item. But I'm gonna start doing stuff right now. And the first item that I don't really wear actually, but, brings me joy, that kind of stuff. It's this caribou coffee hoodie right here. Um, story behind that piece is where, uh, first job really, straight out of high school, or not straight, I was still in high school, junior year. I was there for about two years and that was like one of the first things that I got from my job um, for Christmas. So I'm gonna be keeping that even though I don't really wear it. This one, I do kind of want to keep, but I've never worn this other than like maybe one time. So I think I'll just donate it. Okay, so what I think I'm going to do is for some of these pieces, um, since I'm not really trying them on today, this are some pictures that I've taken from Instagram or that kind of stuff, just to give you a little variety and yeah that's another one where i don't really wear but it's from high school so we'll throw this into the maybe pile i'm not too sure yet here's another one we'll throw another picture up outfit idea got the keep pile pretty big actually over here those are pants that I'm keeping as well over there is the maybe pile we'll keep pile because these are the clothes that I like usually normally wear that's why they're kind of over there instead of in the closet or anything and then here is the donation pile I've got decent like 10 items or so cleared it up a little bit so stuff to also keep or throw into the keep pile I've got a couple clean clothes that I just wore recently. So these are all worn over 30 days. This one I'll throw up a picture as well. 
And there's a whole bunch. There's a couple more sort of things. We've worn these in the past 30 days, but I'm gonna start organizing this stuff, start hanging them up, and then we'll do a time lapse of that too. You guys are pretty much finished up organizing this kind of stuff more or less in some type of order but i've got some pants and stuff over there now that i need to figure out what to do with still the maybe pile and i've got some t-shirts folded up over here i still have some more that i need to do some athletic clothing one more short sleeve t-shirt that i probably won't get anywhere out of this year but i want to hang it up in my closet somewhere I've added a couple more things to the donation pile, so it's looking a little bit bigger. But, so here's the end result, you guys. Um, you know, cleared up a lot of space in there, got rid of a lot of stuff. Here's the donation pile in just a second, but if you enjoyed this video and you want me to make more, uh, please leave a like and a comment down below. Uh, yeah, let me know what videos you want next. I'll show you the donation pile. I'll make a little little montage or something i'm just going to go drop it off but have a lot more room in that little storage bin behind me and this whole area looks a lot nicer all right see you guys